Hi, this video is about the Caribou Mathematics Contest in Canada. I'm going to show the solution for the October 2012 Grade 3 4 Contest Question 10, which also came up in the Grade 5 6, 7 8, and 9 10 contests. So, the question is A bag contains several pieces of paper with one job written on each. There are 10 pieces of paper for doing dishes, 8 for vacuuming, 8 for making beds, and 4 for cleaning toilets. A cleaning team picks from the bag to see what job each person will do. What is the largest number of pieces of paper they can take out to be sure that they have at least one of each job left in the bag? So we know there are 10 pieces of paper for doing dishes, 8 for vacuuming, 8 for making beds, and 4 for cleaning toilets. Well, we know the maximum number such that the conditions are fulfilled would have to be three because even if all three pieces of paper were taken from this pile, then we know that there would still be one of each job left in the bag. But if we take even just one more, which is four, then we cannot be sure that we have one of each job left because there's a possibility of all four pieces of paper being taken from this pile. So the answer is three. But the question is, how would we solve such questions in general? Well, if a question asks for a maximum number, we can either find that maximum number directly, or we can find the minimum number such that the conditions are not fulfilled. Okay, so let this be a number line. And let this and this would be the maximum number such that the conditions are fulfilled. So these would be all the numbers that fulfill the condition, and then these would be all the higher numbers that do not fulfill the conditions. So then one number higher than the maximum number that fulfills the conditions would be the minimum number that does not fulfill the conditions. So now we have a choice. To solve the problem, we can either find the maximum number that does, that does fulfill the conditions, or we can find the minimum number that does not fulfill the conditions. Well, in this case, the easiest thing to do would just be to find the minimum number that does not fulfill the conditions because you would just find the lowest number out of these four numbers, which is four. So we know the minimum number that does not fulfill the conditions would be four because we know if all four pieces of paper were taken, then they could be taken from this pile and then the, the conditions would not be fulfilled. So one less would be three, which is a maximum number that does fulfill the condition. If you'd like to know more about this contest, please feel free to visit our website at www.brocky.ca slash caribou.